everyone, it's Samantha, and today I have an Ulta haul for you guys. I got a big, huge bag at Ulta, and I also got something really big. My wonderful mother-in-law sends me Ulta gift cards because she knows if it's at some place like that, I have to spend it on myself versus like a Target gift card. You know, I would just spend it on our house and on our family. She makes sure that I have to pamper myself. Ulta is one of my favorite girly girl shops, so I was really excited to go there. I don't know when you guys are going to see this video, but right now I am 37 seven and a half weeks pregnant. So heavily pregnant, my feet have been swelling and hurting. And so I wanted to go and get some stuff for pedicure. So the first thing I got is the big thing. Show you guys. It is just a pedicure thing. This one is the True Glow Full Bubble Action and Pinpoint Massage for Happy Feet. It's by Con Air and it was only $30, which I thought was really good. I had been wanting one of these and I almost got one for Christmas this year. But then I changed my mind. I wanted a sewing machine instead. So I ended up skipping this. And since my feet have been swollen, I definitely needed this. So I'm going to really like using this. I'm going to be trying that out tonight. I'm really excited. Ulta also sent me a $10 coupon or gift certificate or something and then also I get their little sales ad in the mail and so it had three dollars and fifty cents off. I went a little crazy and got a bunch of stuff. This is just a bunch for me. Um, so to go along with the pedicure thing I got two of these Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Dead Sea Salt Nourishing Soak and this one's very hippie-tastic. It's got a list of all the things that it doesn't include no parabens, no phthalates, no paraffin, no gluten, no propylene glycol, no mineral oil, no synthetic fragrances, no PABA, no synthetic color, no DEA, no sulfates, and no animal testing. So lots of lots of things that it doesn't include. Like I said, very hippie-tastic. This was the most hippie-tastic one that I could find. And all of the other ones that I found that were like Epsom salts and stuff were mint scented. And if you guys have been following me along on my pregnancy videos, Mint has been one of my major pregnancy aversions, so I definitely couldn't go with the mint anything. I was really excited to find this one that was coconut and hibiscus. It just smells a little bit fresh and coconutty, so definitely not minty. So I went ahead and got two of these because they were buy one, get one 50% off. I think they were like $12.99. Um, so not too bad just for the one and then I got the other one half off. I figure I will go through this stuff pretty fast if I'm going to be soaking my feet every night with my feet hurting the next few weeks. Of course I can always use it later after the baby comes too. I was really looking for more hippie-tastic things to get. We are trying to go all natural with some of our beauty stuff. We're definitely not 100% there or anything, but I just was trying to find the more natural type of products. And while I was looking for stuff, I came across this brand, 100% Pure. And I've never heard of this brand before, but it's just a 100% natural brand. And the things were marked vegetarian or vegan. The scent that stood out to me the most was vanilla bean. I love vanilla bean ice cream. I love the scent of real vanilla. Some of the fake scented vanilla stuff is just not the right thing for me so I absolutely love the smell of this one. I got the vanilla bean shower gel and the vanilla bean nourishing body cream so just a lotion and a shower gel. They're made in the USA and it says on here cruelty free all 100% pure packaging are BPA and phthalate free and all the ingredients like I said, are 100% natural. And this shower gel says 100% vegetarian, which I thought was good. And then the lotion says 100% vegan, which is good. So I'm really excited to give these a try and see what I think. I love the smell of it and it's natural vanilla. It's not the fake stuff and all the ingredients are like different extracts and stuff. So it's really hippie-tastic. Like I said, love hippie-tastic stuff. So I'm really excited about these ones. I'm almost out of my Burt's Bees shampoo and I wanted to try out something else so I picked out this Too Chic Avocado and Olive Oil Ultra Moist Shampoo for dry damaged hair and the other one was for fine hair. It was volumizing which I definitely don't want the volumizing. The Burt's Bee one I has I have now is volumizing. It makes my hair a little bit frizzier and this is by Giovanni Eco Chic Hair Care. On the back it has a little section here. I'll walk you through. A lot of the ingredients are USDA certified, 100% vegetarian ingredients, no animal testing. Avocado and olive oil are rich in vitamin E and omega fatty acids. We do not add parabens, laurel or laureth sulfate or PEGS to this product. So this one's kind of hippie-tastic. I was excited about trying this one out. 
and it just kind of smells like olive oil. It's not very scented or anything. And I just realized I didn't take off my $1.50 coupon, so I'll have to go back to get my little coupon. And then I've been wanting to try this kind of nail polish that I've heard of before. It is Spa Ritual. See that? It's just a bottle of nail polish. I've never tried them before, but they are a vegan brand nail polish, which I thought was really cool. Ulta does sell a bunch of their colors, so I was really excited to get one of those and try it out. It's just a really bright pink, and this color's name is Creamsicle, so super duper bright. And then I got two Essie nail polishes. They're Cashmere Matte Collection. It's a newer collection, and they have this really pretty pink color, so it's going to be kind of a silky finish. I've never tried any of these ones that are called Cashmere or Satin Matte, so I'm excited to try it. And this one's called Just Stitched. It's a light pink. thought that'd be good to use coming up soon. This is an Essie color that I've seen for a long time, and I always go back and forth about getting it. This one is called Naughty Nautical. It's just a nice teal color with a little bit of micro shimmer. And so I'm really excited to finally get this one. I have colors very similar to this, but I just really wanted it. So I finally went and got it. I've been eyeing this color pretty much every time I look at the Essie section. I'm drawn to this color. So I just picked it up. It's probably just kind of a dupe of what I already have, but I really like Essie's colors. So I wanted to go ahead and get it. And that is all I got. So I was really proud to find a couple of brands that are kind of hippie-tastic. And I'm going to be excited to try out some of these things. And I'm definitely excited about the pedicure stuff. I'm going to be using that stuff pretty much every day. Just because my feet are so swollen and sore at this point. It's perfect for pregnancy. And I'd been wanting one anyway. So it'll come in handy even after she's here. Just so I can pamper myself a little bit. So hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Be sure to subscribe to this channel. So you can follow me along on all of my videos and I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.